Then it's code in the D to give the keyboard a punch. Wow. Then cross, correlate, and a break for some lunch. Wow. Correlate, tabulate, process, and screen. Wow. Program, print out, regress to the mean. And it's oh boys, can't you code it? <laughs> Program it right. Nothing ever happens in the The first method for data entry and data we're going to look at is using an input mode and entering data from the keyboard. It's probably the least useful, but it does show you the basics of how to get data into Stata, and we can also write a program and put it in a do file to enter this data for small problems. So we're going to use the input command. Remember, anytime you need help with a command, type help in the name of the command, in this case, help input. And I'm going to start with input, and I go down to the command window. And now I need to start laying out my variables. If I have all numeric variables, I can just type in variable names. If I have any string variables, I have to declare them. So you can see the data. I have five cases. And my first variable is a string that has a maximum of six characters wide. And we'll call that sex. And then we have race, age, and education. When I hit the Enter key, you can see it in the, in the review window, in the results window, that uh, Stata is now ready to accept my first line of data. Now I've reached the end. You can see that I can't go back and make any changes or editing. So if I've made an error, it'll be in my data set and I'll have to correct it later. And I just type end. And that completes my data entry. I can now list the data, describe the data, and anything I want. Now I entered these without any errors, so that actually worked pretty well. And I may want to come back to these data another time. So I'm going to open up a do file and I'm going to come over here to where I entered the commands and I'm going to highlight all of the commands I just entered and right click and I can either send them to the do file editor uh, I'll just copy them and come into the do file editor right click and paste now if I run this program now it will fail because Stata won't let me destroy something in memory. Um, you know, it's, it prevents me from doing destructive things to my data, but if I issue the clear command first and then I run this program, it should go ahead and enter these data and list them out. So there we go, that's the first one. Now I can save this do file and uh, when I come back, I can run this program and pick up where I left off. Again, my suggestion is that you play with this a little bit and um, get used to the using input within a do file. It is actually pretty helpful for doing small problems. If you're dealing with a data set with thousands of cases, not as useful, but we'll show you other methods for dealing with those data. And it's code in the D to give the keyboard a punch wow. Then cross, correlate, and a break for some lunch wow. Correlate, tabulate, process, and screen wow. Program, print out, regress to the mean And it's old boys, can't you code it? <laughs> Program it right, nothing ever happened